This series is about going for the max cape on an ultimate Iron Man. Chances are you already know what an ultimate Iron Man account's restrictions are, but in case this is your first time watching a video from me, I basically can't use the bank or trade with other players. At first, this mode seems very outlandish and dumb, maybe it even seems difficult, but it's not that bad. It's super fun having to find new ways to gather items and strategize which ones I will go for first, and putting all the pieces of the puzzle together, so to speak. In this episode, I'm going to finish 99 crafting. This goal has to be one of the biggest sub goals I have ever set on this account. I've had to jump through so many hoops in order to get here. Episode 14 was when I first started talking about the 99 crafting grind. Since then, I've gotten from 34 million total experience all the way to 85 million total experience. And the reason for it being one of the biggest sub goals is because I decided to get 99 rune crafting beforehand so that I didn't waste a very, very small amount of time while training crafting from level 61 to 79. To put it into perspective, the original 61 to 79 crafting grind would take around 20 hours, potentially 25 hours of playtime. And if I waited to get 99 rune crafting when I was around 97 crafting, that same 1.6 million experience from rune crafting is less time saved. It's around 16 hours because crafting after 87 is about 100k an hour when all is said and done. I went out of my way for an entire 300 hour grind just to save 4 hours, maybe 9 hours tops. That's if I didn't do anything out of order or with less efficiency. That's the type of person, account, and series you're watching. Welcome to UIMP Season 1, Episode 26. One more. That's 97. Woo! All right. Of course, nothing unlocked. I think the next thing is at 98, though. Um, 1.1 mil experience till 98 and 2.3 until, or a little bit more than 2.3, but uh, until 99. So that's pretty sweet, getting really close. Uh, I'm not going to get it today. I'm not even going to get 98 today. Um, I'm going to do probably another 800 to 900K uh, before I go to bed. And then I'll finish up the rest of 97 to 98 and then 98 to 99 uh, tomorrow. Uh, before I sleep so it's it's been quite a grind but um, it's it's been fun um, it's taken t today's uh, day seven uh, so it will have taken me eight days uh, to go from 79 to 99 so I I would imagine that's pretty good um, I did get the world record for UIM week um, both on are you serious? <laughs> Both on Crystal Math Labs and, uh, well, I haven't gotten it on Temple OSRS because I haven't been able to update the um, the data points. But uh, on Temple OSRS, it is eight million experience, and uh, my current record, I think, right now is uh, eight point two. But I have not logged out for almost five hours, as you can see down there. Um, and I think it, it updated to 7.95 because, again, this is day seven. So it's starting to update the experience from uh, day one. Because day one wasn't just 24 hours. It was, I say day one, but it wasn't really fully day one. Um, it was it was like 36 hours or something like that. So, um yeah, so it's starting to kind of catch up with me a little bit, but the good thing is that on the first day that I started doing this, um, I only got 700k XP in a day, or in that 36 hour period, so there's a lot of wiggle room there. So I will end the, uh, I will set the new week record, I think, a little bit over 10 mil XP uh, in crafting, which is, that's pretty good. So for the last 30 minutes, I have been basically racing the system update timer because I really want to get 98 before this happens. Um, they gave a notification saying that for 30 minutes after the system update hits, you're not going to be able to log in. All worlds are going to be offline. So I'm a bit upset about that because, I mean, it's 30 minutes, yeah, but 
Um, I'm basically racing against the week time right now because today is day eight, but day seven, or I guess day two, didn't start until uh, 36 hours after day one started. So I'm basically racing myself um, for when I actually started day two. That way I can get the, um, I mean, I've already gotten the world record for crafting on a UIM week, but um, I'd like to get it up past uh, 10, I would like to get it past 10 mil. Um, and the most that I can get is 10.3 because of the way um, day one happened. Um, which is fine, it's totally fine. Um, but in order to uh, get that 10.3, I, I literally only have an hour of buffer time and maybe an hour and a half. And this half hour digs into that. So um, that, that means less breaks for me. And also um, yesterday, day seven, um, got cut short a little bit early because the power at my house went out and I was at 1.34 mil XP for the day and I, I didn't know when it was going to come back on so I just went to bed. I ended up sleeping I think 10 hours which which also is fine um, but again that means today I have to get 1.8 mil experience which I have never done. Yeah see look it says after the count or, or uh, oh, I can't even talk old school we'll stay offline for 30 minutes um, or a update preparations but we're 1k away from uh 98 so i will be able to get that because it's in four minutes so Whew, i was racing against that i wasn't sure if i was going to get it because it was 47k away uh from the level at 27 minutes of so i basically just had to speed up a little bit um i need to pick up these these um molten glass because if i don't do this um, I won't have enough giant seaweed for 99 itself, um, but I don't have to do it every single time because uh, of how many giant seaweed I ended up having. The calculation that I was following was a little bit off. They said you get 8.7 um, molten glass per giant seaweed or something like that, which is actually a fair bit low. That's if you um, are only picking up some of them, but if you pick up all of them, um, you're gonna get a little bit more than that and this should be the level Here it is uh, Let me turn this stuff off. Yeah, here we go. There we go 98 crafting one level to go um, Ooh, See every single time I say what do we get? What do we unlock but the time I didn't say that uh, You can craft Zenite amulets, which I believe is the last Zenite one. Let me just quickly look uh, under jewelry Yeah, it's the last it's the last one um, I don't know if you unlock anything other than the cape at 99. We're going to be able to get all these light orbs in before, before it gets here. Yes, yes, yes. All right. Perfect. <laughs> now we got to reset rune light. <sighs> Still nothing. Okay, I don't know how long this is going to take. It's been probably 29 minutes. All right. It's Finally, time to get this 99. Where's, where's I messed up? But that's fine. <laughs> of, of course I messed up. <laughs> Dang it. Um, I think I have one extra giant seaweed that is just gonna... Yeah, I, I'm pretty sure. So we'll keep that as a novelty. <laughs> but uh, the reason why it was so perfect in number or almost perfect is because I started just basically not picking up any of the molten glass um, from the ground at around 600k till 99 because um, it's faster experience and also I didn't get any extra experience past 99 um, and it should be here any moment uh, we got three left two left one left and this should be it there it is And we still got two molten glass, so uh, what do we unlock other than the cape? Just the cape. Congratulations, you are now a master of crafting. Wow. 
why not visit the Master Craftsman at the Crafting Guild? He has something special that is only available to true masters of the crafting skill. Perfect. Nothing else unlocked. Um, I'm going to finish up this stuff. I'll meet you guys over there. Honestly, I am going to uh, use this last giant seaweed. I know I got 99 already, but why the heck not? Let's do it. And we'll use all these up. Um, I would like to use these 495 buckets of sand as well. Um, but I'll probably just store that. I'm not going to do that today. I'm going to go to bed and then figure out what I'm going to do tomorrow. But before I do that, I'm going to go get the crafting cape. But I just wanted to get that last seaweed out of the way. Ah, it is time to get off of this spell book just for a little bit. Talk to the master crafter. Dude's old. You will shit. Okay. Uh, yeah, that's fine. I'd like to get that. Beautiful, beautiful. All right, let's put this thing on. Here we go. Oh, it's so cool. Get okay. out of here, kid. I love it. It does, does it even match this apron? It's a little off on the color. But, um, yeah, let me do the emote real quick. Quickly. Nice. Not too bad, not too bad. Now, the main thing... Be gone. I got work to do. This is, is literally just so that I could go and use this basket here. Which, I don't even know if I unlocked it yet. But, um, so if we take the cape off and put it, like, at the bottom, it's not going to be... Uh, I'm going to have to uh, change... Probably change it to shift click or whatever but if we do this we teleport teleports this super close to this little bank here which you know as an ultimate iron man you cannot use it but uh if i wanted to i could use these on here and unnote them which i'm not going to because i don't think there's any way to renote those um but yeah so let me put this kit back on it's freaking awesome and uh this glass blowing pipe needs to uh needs to I wish I could wield that, to be honest. That'd be pretty cool. But I have to give a big shout-out to the two cabbages that have helped me to get 99 crafting. I could not have done it as fast as I did without them. So, big shout-out to them. Um, <laughs> that's just so dumb. I'm so freaking tired, dude. I've done um, 1.225 mil plus 600k earlier today. I don't know. Hey, Bob. Um, this is Bob, right? Why can't I, why can't I click on this? What? Oh, this is probably actual Bob. Leave my cat alone. Anyways, anyways. So, 87.9 million experience on the account. We are officially a master crafter. <laughs> and I don't have a pickaxe, but... This cape is freaking awesome. It's going to be great for construction. Uh, going for the 99 construction grind. I'm going to do a little bit uh, of stuff in the meantime before I start doing another big grind like this. Uh, but more on that when I wake up again because I'm just too tired to explain anything. But yeah. Subscribe to this channel. Now be gone. Turn off the music, I'm gonna nap.